Okay, everyone. This is Let's Play Rogue Legacy. My duties are my family. But I am loyal only to myself. This is a action roguelike made by Silidori Games. It's actually just released today. Object of the game. Well, we'll get there. Old age of fire. Job's already done. We can do that. Uh, it's really quite a good game. I purchased it early and uh, got to play the demo. I mean, it's not very long, it only takes about an hour or so. And it was quite fun. So, yeah, we've already done that. We already know that. This is basically just, you know, obviously it's a tutorial. Tutorial. stuff because it truthfully doesn't matter. And I kill the king. It starts my legacy. Alright. I don't think there's anything here we need to change. No. So let's start. Okay, so my name is Sir Lee. I'm a knight. Strength is 25, magic is 25, armor is 0. I can hit X to see my card. As you can see, I'm rather... It's quite interesting that the card looks like a magic card. That's pretty cool. I'm a rather boring little bland person. I have 100 hit points, 100 magic. I'm just going to go into... So this game has randomly generated dungeons. This lets you teleport, but you obviously have to find another thing. This, I believe, is where the main boss is. Hit this at any time to see that. General Entry 1. Treason! An assassin has wounded my father, the king. To bring order back to the kingdom, he sent my siblings and I on a quest to save him. Together we will venture into the cursed woods and enter... Castle Hampson. This cursed castle has stood on the edge of the woods since time immemorial. Immemorial. But rumors say that within it, dwe it dwells an item which will cure any ailment. Tonight, I will get a head start over my brothers and sisters and set forth on my quest while they lay asleep. To fail this quest would be an embarrassment to my name. Randomly generated. I'm gonna die already. Ow! Oh, 
when I died. I didn't see that there. Great. So I've been slain by a guard box. Fairy chests hold all the runes in the game. Runes will help you immensely. So and we haven't found one of those yet. So as you can see, I killed three floaty head things, two guard boxes, a painting, and one of the big guys. So press A to move on. And eh, that's my previous card. Shows how much money I got. Now I choose an heir. So we have the knight. Oh, he has what is it? Eidetic memory, but he also has dyslexia. <laughs> uh, Lady Stephanie has Alzheimer's. Sir Judson, the knave, has irritable bowel, bowel syndrome. That's IBS. So basically, anytime I jump, I fart. And tunnel vision. No peripheral vision. I don't think I've ever actually seen that one. I think we're gonna go... Well, you see, they also have three different classes. A knave. I have low hit points, but basically they have a higher chance of... Uh, or they don't have a higher chance of critical strikes, they just do more damage. Instead of 150%, it's like 250%. So they can do more damage. Uh, the Barbarian has more hit points. And the Knight is basically just that. Yeah, pretty much has the same stuff. Giant Axe, a Scythe, or a Chakram. See, he had uh, just throwing knives, which are pretty crappy. Uh, I think we'll go with Sir Doom. Alright, so we have 410 gold to spend. First thing we can do is unlock the smithy. Build the finest equipment in the world. Turning you into a veritable, virtuous, violent villain vaporizer. And nice. Gathering blueprints will give him an even wider array of assorted armaments for your armory. Okay. And there's other stuff to build, to, to buy. Well, okay. You can increase health by 10 for 60 gold, or you can increase your mana by 10 for 60 gold. And you can do that 75 times. I think we will buy extra hit points. As you can see, it makes it to where our knights then turn into paladins, which give them... makes it to where you can hit the Y button to block incoming damage, but it requires mana. I didn't say anything about this, this is just Rex dummy. It's silly. I give up, the tickle, it hurts, train dummy, weak. Why do you do this pain? It hurts so much. So yeah. Welcome, hero! Maybe you can help me. I used to be the greatest blacksmith in all of the lands. Clearly, it's dyslexia, but. But one day, the. Hmm, I don't know. Well, the castle attacked my smithy. The monsters. The monsters of this castle attacked my smithy and stole all my blueprints. Without those blueprints, I can only make uh, cutlery. Is it cutlery? Cutlery and stuff. Please bring back my, any blueprints you find, and I will build the most amazing equipment ever. Ever. At a price, of course. So as you can see, there are three blueprints currently. Uh, there's the Squire Limbs, which increases your magic by five. There is the Squire Helm, which increases your health and mana. And there's the Sword, which increases your damage. But we're going to go with damage first. And I'll leave 50. Let's see, is there anything I can spend 50 on? No, there is not. Okay, there's a reason why, as I'll show you. Come over here, talk to him. One must pay the toll. I have to give him all my money to enter the castle. If I confirm, he laughs. Okay. So remember how I said everything was random? Well, this is still the same, I believe. Yeah, yeah. It's still the same. That's still the same. So yes, everything is tired.
entirely random. Ow. Muddle. Ow. Ah, damn it. Charlotte is gay. Standard hero, pretty good at everything. Knight. Lady Lisa the Mage. Powerful spellcaster. Every kill gives you mana. Farsighted. Everything close up is blurry. And hyper gonadism. Your permaroided attacks to knock enemies further back. It just has daggers. Uh, every kill gives you mana. You're gay. And you're an ectomorph, so you're skinny, so every time you get hit, shit hurts. Alright, uh, we'll go Sir Jacob. I'm not entirely sure what being gay actually does in this game. So we'll see. I only have 55 dollars. Not cool. to pain. No, no pain. Wow. Faster movement because of ADHD. Nostalgic. Miss the good old days. An EDS. You are very flexible. Hmm. I'm not sure what that does. Let's get that. So I'm Lady Stephanie. Unfortunately, I still haven't made any damn money. That's my magic. Blade wall. It's pretty cool. Let's see if we can actually get a good run this time. Jeez. Wonderful. 
a little better at least. Let's see what's over here. Ooh. Do you pray for assistance? Ooh. Found Charon's Orb Opal. Okay, what is that to? Only... Okay. Hmm. I have no idea what that does. Cool. Hey, okay, health. What the hell does that do? Does that respawn all the end? Okay, no. Chickens freak you out. <laughs> Alright. Barbarian walking tank. And endomorph. And dwarfism. The knave is kind of crappy though. I think I like the barbarian the most. So I got 2800. I think we're gonna buy something from Doodsy here. Yeah. Cost 200, so can't do that. Let's that. Uh, promote your knights to paladins. And block blows. And I'll just end up losing 60, I guess. So as you can see, everything goes up in price when I purchase something else. Pretty annoying. Ah! Ooh, I have the chakram again. What does that do? Oh. Oh. Cool. So let me save my money. That's awesome. So that's new. Ah, you butthole. Oh, 
how are you supposed to make it through that? What's that? See, that's a place that I believe if you're a dwarf you can go through. So now let's... Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ooh! That's huge! Oh! Oh! He's gonna kill me. No! Die! No! Damn it! See, you have Sir Dude the Second, Sir Lady Stephanie the Second, ADHD, and can't see in 3D, hypochondriac. We tend to exaggerate. <laughs> and miss the good old days. Mm. Ooh, Lady Stephanie. Unlocks this stuff. Definitely want the architect. Because that lets you lock down a castle so that it doesn't change. Yeah, we'll go and get the enchantress too. Yeah, that's what you use your runes and stuff for. You see the stereo 3D. Hello, hero! Could I borrow your ear for a moment? I'm in need of your help. I used to be a very powerful enchantress, but one day the monsters of this castle invaded my dreams and stole my knowledge. They encased that knowledge in runes, and without those runes, I suck at my job. Please, hero, if you find my runes, bring them back to me. Then I'll sell it back to you at a profit. <laughs> so you have a sprint rune, which gives you the power to dash certain short distances. You have the vault rune, which allows you to double jump. And you have... Oh, that's it. Just this. So, oh, oh, that's not what I meant to do. So that's the stereo 3D thing, in effect. Greetings, boy! Wanna know a cool fact? I'm crazy! Slugger here, for the simple fool, I can prevent the castle from changing. This way, you can go... You, this way, you can... This way, you can go through exactly what your ancestors went through. Impressed? You should be. How did I build this fantastic contraption? With science, of course, and magic. Mostly magic. My skills aren't free. Flying in the castle takes 70% of all the gold you earn. 70%?! No, no, I get 70%. Sure, we'll lock it down. I like that castle setup. Enjoy! Maybe you can reach some treasures your ancestors missed. Oops. I'll give you all the money to get in there. So you can see with the ADHD, we're quite fast. So no place to teleport. To. Dude. 
seven. Which really isn't that big. But it does happen. Okay, so we have the fairy place. Shit, I just hit the wrong button again. Oh, I missed this one more. Turn around tree number two. Although I'm the eldest child, I am not my father's favorite. I have always known he planned to leave me with nothing. But if I find the cure, everything will change. The victor will earn nothing less than the throne upon his passing. Upon my ascension, my wife and my child shall move back into the royal quarters, back to the royal city, where we once again be treated with the respect we deserve. No longer will we stand for the gossip and petty slander of my cousins. The other dukes shall bow as we pass. I am getting ahead of myself. Let's keep my priorities clear. Conquer the castle. Find the cure. Collect my reward. Wow. Paid my dues and entered the castle proper. That devil Sharon has taken all that I own as payment. He has even pilfered my private coffers. I have left my wife and child, children with nothing. He says it's the price for any and all who, who hazard the depths of the castle. He says it is fair. It's fair because all who have entered, none have returned. But I will change that. I will be victorious. There is no greater swordsman than I, even amongst my siblings. <laughs> Second area. I don't want to go there yet, though. We're gonna do this, though. We're gonna do it the easy way. Instead of venturing back through that other place. So I gotta bend this one. Oh! I didn't see that. Aw, oh, damn it! So we run into a boss. Let's see if we can find anything. Whoa! What the hell am I supposed to do about that? Oh, it killed me! Oh no! Guard box 2000. Alright, so dyslexia. That's a paladin with a chakram. Mage with Tourette's. Oh. Time stop is pretty cool. Sounds pretty cool, at least. Endomorph. Uh, hmm. Lady Chun Li. <laughs> with a beard. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Uh, play, we'll play a circle Clabber. So I got 399. We're gonna 
do that. I'll break the barbarian. Let's roll down. Ooh. Shinobi. 470. Nice. So, I didn't get anything to actually unlock any of this stuff, but we will do this again. So that we get to whatever... Well, for one thing, we can easily teleport back to where we were before. But... Ah! You weren't there before. Maybe you were. Yeah, yeah, you were. You were there before. Ah. Ah. Have a chance at this fairy chest again, right? Nope, nope, no. Nope. Crap! One button. Fairy chest is up here. Oh! No, it wouldn't let me jump. Ow. Damn it, I just took unnecessary damage. Son of a bitch. Yep. Time you die, you use the, you use the thing to unlock the place again. You get another try at the fairy test. So if you get a place like this, to where you have a chance at something like that, you, uh, you pretty much want to take a chance at it because because if you can get it, it's really good. Okay, we're gonna go actually go down because. Direction I didn't search. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. What? No, you don't. No, you don't. special traits. Okay, let's go with the king here. So we need 470 to unlock that. Good lord. Okay, so we have 210. I'm absolutely ginormous. I don't really need that. Let's see. Can I unlock? Let's see if I can get that. Or I could get double jump. Let's get double jump. So now I have double jump. It's amazing. 70% of my money. I'm fucking ginormous. And if I'm not mistaken, I actually do more damage? Something. 
huge HP, low strength, and MP. Oh. So I actually don't do more damage because I'm a barbarian. As you can see, the sword reaches a much higher area. Wow. <laughs> the second there, I, I thought I wasn't going to be able to jump through that. That had pretty messed up. Ah! Yep, that's not happening. spells properly. <laughs> uh, sure. We'll go with the Paladin. 196 is all. Shit. Well, I believe that might actually be enough for this. No! Oh, 350! I forgot it almost doubles in price when you buy the first one. Crap. Increase our hit points by 10. Yes. <laughs> it goes the wrong way. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. That's good stuff. Oh. Really? Dude, it remembers all of the enemies. What the hell? That's crazy! That is awesome! Pretty 
That was a... Jesus, that was a lot of money. the first episode of Let's Play Rogue Legacy. Come back as we uh, probably check out one of the Vertigo guys, because holy shit, it's pretty much the most amazing thing ever. So, see you next time.